guys, it's Petrina, your go-to girl for learning how to make fit work in a crazy busy world. And it has been a crazy busy week five of my carb cycling adventure. I am super stoked to report that I am down a total of 14 pounds since starting this five weeks ago. 13 inches, a good chunk off my waist. I don't have, of course I don't have the paper in front of me, but I will show you my pants are still not falling off, but they're getting quite close and I'm getting a case of the droopy drawers when I'm out and about. Let me show you. Yeah, see, literally droopy drawers. Wow. Oh, I'm so excited. Who would have thought that you could sit there and be eating bacon and cheese, I love cheese, and, and still managing to lose weight and hopefully laser targeting the fat, which is why I'm doing this. Let's be honest here, I'm doing this to lean out and look as healthy as possible in the process and maintain as much muscle mass as I can. I had my first ever carb night. I don't know if you've been keeping up, but I was doing the Chris Powell plan and I switched over to carb night solution where I was basically ketogenic, very ultra low carb. I think I'm averaging about like 15 net carbs a day and that is, you know, total carbohydrates minus fiber. That's how you come up with a usable or net carb. And had my first ever carb night starting at around 5 p.m. and I kicked it off with a plate of my favorites, mini penne, I love that pasta, with some marinara sauce, a roll, I enjoyed a dinner roll with it, and some delicious chicken teriyaki pineapple meatballs. So that was my dinner and that's how I kicked it off. And then the rest of the evening I, I had snacks. I enjoyed things that I haven't been able to enjoy. I had a cherry turnover. I had a couple of donuts. I had ice cream. I had some chips. It was a really nice filling evening and I even had a couple of drinky drinks for good measure. So I hope I rounded it out nicely. I didn't feel, you know, I didn't feel sick or terribly bloated the next day. And as you probably noticed, I'm wearing a shirt. I'm not being paid to wear the shirt. I just think it's super cool. I have friends over in Anna, Texas who run a CrossFit box. I do not do CrossFit, but you know, if I lived in or near Anna, Texas, I would probably do CrossFit just because these two are just so amazingly cool and talented and passionate and they know their stuff. So if I was gonna do CrossFit, I would do CrossFit at CrossFit TBR. I met the couple who runs this particular CrossFit, Stacy and Sean, back at Disney a year or two ago. I don't even know, but they're just, they're awesome people. I'm feeling pretty good five weeks in, surprisingly so, and it has not been complete torture for me to, to really do such a, a drastic change in the amount of carbohydrates I'm having per day. My energy levels are good. You know, I started off today even going for a long walk and hitting my 10,000 step minimum daily goal by 10 a.m. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna pat myself on the back about that one. I'm feeling leaner, I'm feeling happier, I'm feeling stronger. So I am excited for the next, what the next few weeks hold. I'll still doing Pio and I freaking love it even more in month two. If you wanna learn more about Pio, you can click on the box right up here. To learn all about this amazing program. I am rocking tricep push-ups in Pio, which I have never done, done before. I typically have to get on my knees after the first, you know, three or four for tricep push-ups, and now I can bang out, you know, 15 on my toes easy, which is cool. So that's my five-week report. As always, if you have any questions, you can email me at coachpetrina at yahoo.com. If you'd like to sign up for absolutely free fitness coaching with me, you can do so at makefitwork.com. Or you can just surf around on my crazy, sexy, cool website over at patrinihamfitness.com. That's it. Take care and have a great day. Bye-bye.